Welcome back. Global Warming, a story of crisis and opportunity. Global warming refers to the rise in the average temperature of the Earth's surface and atmosphere caused by the buildup of greenhouse gases in the air. Greenhouse gases have the ability to trap heat and prevent it from escaping into space. Common greenhouse gases include carbon dioxide, methane, nitrous oxide, and fluorinated gases. Multiple sources have identified the major culprits behind global warming. Fossil fuels are the main culprits behind human-induced greenhouse gas emissions, as they are burnt for electricity generation, heating, and transportation. These fossil fuels, including coal, oil, and gas, contribute to over 75% of global greenhouse gas emissions and nearly 90% of carbon dioxide emissions. The countries with the highest carbon dioxide emissions are China, the United States, the European Union, India, Russia, and Japan. Apart from fossil fuels, the industrial sector also plays a significant role in greenhouse gas emissions. Manufacturing, mining, and construction activities release substantial amounts of greenhouse gases. This is primarily due to the burning of fossil fuels for energy and the chemical reactions involved in converting raw materials into finished goods. The industrial sector alone accounts for 23% of greenhouse gas emissions in the United States, and that number increases to 30% when considering electricity usage. Developing countries like India and China are experiencing a rapid rise in industrial emissions as their economies grow. Additionally, the agricultural sector plays a significant role in contributing to global warming. This is mainly due to the release of methane and nitrous oxide from activities such as livestock farming, manure management, rice cultivation, and fertilizer use. Furthermore, agriculture also contributes to deforestation and land degradation, which further releases carbon dioxide stored in plants and soil. Agriculture accounts for 17.3% of the world's methane emissions and 6.2% of nitrous oxide emissions. Activities related to land use and forestry can either contribute to or reduce greenhouse gas emissions, depending on how they are managed. Deforestation, logging, fires, and urbanization release carbon dioxide from vegetation and soil into the atmosphere. On the other hand, afforestation, reforestation, conservation, and restoration efforts can help absorb carbon dioxide and improve carbon sinks. In the United States, land use and forestry activities have a positive impact by acting as a net sink for greenhouse gas emissions. They offset approximately 12% of the country's overall greenhouse gas emissions. Save the planet. Thanks for watching. 